careful for throwing stones in somebody's best house. It is unfair to ask for something you are not willing to give. I suggest you don't want to be turned into a commodity. I don't also suggest you don't want that your parents are raising you, but saying to you, and let it be clear to you, that you will be sold as a sex slave when you are 16 years old or 80 years old. 18 years old. Since it is unfair to ask for something you are not willing to give. And peace begins on the dinner table. It is easy to say that you must go vegan. Why? Animals don't want to be your food choices. And no matter what your corrupt government say, Animals are not inanimate objects. They are living sentient beings with a central nervous system connected to a brain. They have emotions just like you or just like me. You know that self entitled, self righteous, delusional mindset that you use to say that animals and you justified your belief that animals are just objects is the same psychotic delusional self-entitled self-serving rubbish that slave masters say when they speak about blacks as sexists say when they speak about women they don't look like me they don't act like me Therefore, they don't matter. They don't. aren't doing the exact same thing I do. They don't like the things I do. Get the reality. People, your rights start. when you are ready to give rights to other living beings and your end, rights end when you are starting to violate the rights of others so stop making excuses animals don't want to be your victim you don't want to be a victim of a pedophile or a rapist or some other abuser. And since it is unfair to ask for something you are not willing to give, and I suggest you don't want to be uh, get an extremely nice um, growing up, but then when you are 16 or 70, somebody sell you to a sex worker, a sex prostitute uh, pimp or so you flash to a cannibal that's what you actually say and that you think it is okay to murder animals as you treat them humanely what's the difference? cows can live to the age of 25 and um, they are killed on the age of 5 Are you uh, understand that? Why are you going? You don't have rights to abuse animals just because your stupid laws say that. Laws are not justice. Laws are a bunch of of uh, collection of um, rules made up by people long ago and how are just arbitrary a lot of the time we have laws to protect, to protect children we have even laws in my country at least to protect mental retarded people but we have no rights to protect our cows 
no rights to protect chickens. You can put a chi um, uh, 20,000 chickens in one warehouse. And if you don't put them in cages, you can even call it free range. What the hell? I'm ashamed of um, my species. I always claim they are so humane and therefore call themselves humans. Since the words human and humane are uh, etymology. Uh, from the etymology, the same word. They both come from the word humanis, with mercy. And then we claim we are wise. What is wise about destroying whole entire habitats of living beings? I can better say or better call you hominids because you have not evolved from that state of evolution into a more evolved, wiser state. I can better call you Homo superbia, which means the blind proud man, or Homo megalomania, which means something like a narcissistic man self-centered, self-entitled little pricks. Yes, I know, my words are hard and controversial to some of you, but this does not mean that it is not true. All true past three stages. First, it is mad and radical. Secondly, it is violently opposed. Then, after years of fighting, of debating, of argumenting, and some economical sabotage. We come to the next state, the last state, exception. People understand, don't make excuses anymore, because the activists that humiliate those who make the excuses about it. Let them look like devils. <sighs> Compassion for all living beings is a mark, a mark of a civilized society. Cockfighting, rodeos, suits, horse fighting, slaughterhouses, execution chambers. And such places are all mark of a of an uncivilized cult. One how is brutal, one is how is devilish, and how must be abolished. And not make the apologies for it. Something is not wrong because it is tradition. Tell that to slave masters. I think they love to hear that. People who eat com cut up corpses and secretions of animals. So don't be so evil as slave masters like Hammond or so despicable as people like Hitler, who believe in might make right. Compassion should always trump in imaginal, systematic oppression, torture and holocaust. <laughs>